Hey guys, I'm back. I went and put my face on for you. So now on to the second video of today for my wonderful subscribers. I will be doing a review on this awesome and from what I've gathered, extremely painful face mask. Now, I opened this last night and used it on my cousin and on my son's father. My cousin was like, whatever. He rinsed it off. He was too scared to pull it. But my son's father, he put it up on his shoulder area where he has a lot of acne issues going on because he didn't want to put on his face because he's got a lot of facial hair. Um and it ripped every hair he had on his back right out it also pulled blackheads whiteheads it was <laughs> whoa and he said it was kind of like having a super glued band-aid put on you and then ripped off anyways i have my little guy and he's bugging the crud out of me right now so i'm going to pause this deal with him and i will be right back with all y'all Okay, hey, I'm back. Sorry. I have a four-year-old that will not ever be quiet. So, back to this. I will be using this later on and doing it all for you guys on camera and telling you if the struggle and pain is that bad or not. Because I know two women that use this once a week, every week, and they swear by it. So, that is what is up. We're gonna do this. We're gonna rip it off. We're gonna goop it up. We're gonna get black, peely, masky greatness with this. So that's what's gonna happen. So my four-year-old is going to just hang out, you guys. So this is that, God, I hate the lighting in here. This is that, anyways, so I'll just tell ya. It is the Davines Love Conditioner. It is empty. Um, I used the shampoo and the conditioner. Um, this is going to be a review for that. They did not pay me yet again. These came out of my birch box. Um, but these are no joke. I will be buying full sizes of these. I absolutely love them. They're the, 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 the excuse me. They're the Devine's Love Conditioner and Shampoo. Lovely smoothing conditioner for coarse and frizzy hair. Um, when I put the shampoo on, it was very uh, clean smelling, um, lathered up really good, made my hair feel extremely clean at the end. And then when I put this in, it was heaven. My hair became instantly very smooth, very smooth and soft. Um, just, it was awesome. Like today it feels very smooth and soft. I'm trying to repair the damage from all the excessive dyeing I was doing that had chemicals and caused a lot of really bad icky foo -foos. So this is really good. Um, I also there for a while was using the head and shoulders volume boost that I received for complimentary for testing purposes through Influencer. And then I got my birch boxes, which had these in it. And I said, oh, I'm gonna try those because I want to give a good review or a bad review, whatever one it, they end up being to people so they know. Um, so this is a very good review. 100% love these guys, Devines. You've got their shit down. Um, I um, can't say enough good about it. It smells good, feels good. I left it in for three minutes. Um, it says three to five on the back of the package. Um, it was crazy how like how it felt. It was just oh, it was amazing. So good review for the shampoo and the conditioner for that company as well. Um, my birthday is Monday, so whatever our gifts I receive, if they're high end into makeup, drugstore makeup, whatever, everybody knows this girl wants makeup. I need makeup because I have classes that I'm going to be starting that require makeup as well as I love makeup and for you guys, so I can give you guys uh, different makeup looks, different stuff and how I think it works, how good it is, the price of it, where to find it, 
all that greatness. Um, I also will be uploading another video here in a little while, like I said in the first, for some, you know, maybe we'll just do it now. We'll do it now. So lately I have seen a lot of the declutter videos and different stuff like that. And, you know, I'm a new YouTuber and I know that if I had an overabundance of stuff that wasn't used real bad and I had a new YouTuber that came to me and said, hey, you know, Veronica, can I please have any of your stuff that you're going to throw away? It's my little dude back there. Y'all are seeing. Sorry. He wanted to blog with mommy today. So I said, okay. But anyway, um, I would be more than happy to send you any of the products in makeup or skincare or hair care or anything that I receive that I have extra of or that I just don't use because I want to see everybody else succeed and be happy. One day I would like to be like some of the bigger beauty bloggers that have the, the nice cameras and the high subscribers and the, so many likes and you've got companies sending them PR packages and this and that because I just think it would be super awesome. It'd be like Christmas all the time. And it would show, you know, it would show me that they appreciate what I do um, more than right now. Like, you know, I guess I have come up a long way in the last month and a half. I have made it to 20 subscribers, which to a lot of the, the bigger people that may watch this, that probably seems like nothing because woo, 20 subscribers ain't nothing compared to 700,000 or a million or whatever. But I've also only been doing this a month and a half roughly. And I could not, I don't know. I just couldn't see my life without it now. Um, I will be starting a whole bunch of different videos where I'm going to be taking you guys shopping to Alta and Sephora with me and a couple other places. So I'm sorry I keep having to pause this. My son is absolutely rambunctious right now, bouncing on my bed, and I don't want him to fall because next to my bed is a table with sharp corners and no hospital trips for me today. Anyways, back to what I was saying. I just, I don't see why they don't, the, the bigger blogs don't care. They don't want to help. They don't want to listen to the stories. They don't want to do any of that stuff. It's like, so... I don't know. I just, it's almost like they get snobby when they get, they get bigger. Like, oh yeah, you know, like they forgot they were there before they, they were here where I'm at. They, they were, you know, beginning and not, you know, maybe they're not in the same situation to me, you know, where they have a child and very, you know, very limited income, you know, they have kids and families and very limited incomes to where when you start out, you're using your iPhone on a stool in your bedroom like me with the sun as your lighting um they it's like they seem to forget that that at some point you know not everybody goes okay i'm gonna be a youtuber and i'm gonna go out and spend three thousand dollars on makeup and another couple hundred on lighting and i'm gonna set up a whole little room with all the stuff that's gonna cost me another couple thousand dollars that's not reality for for some of us yeah some you can do that i can't do that nor what I really want to on something that I don't know for sure is going to go very far. Now, I do love to blog, so I will be getting those things. But because of my situation, it will take me a lot longer. Um, so, yes, when I go on and I see these people giving makeup away or doing this or doing that or throwing stuff away, I am first to say, hey, I'm a new YouTuber. My money's tight uh, because of situations in my life. Um... If you're going to throw that, can you send it my way? I can use it and give my personal review on that product as well as use it for classes. And when, you know, if I don't like the product when I'm done, I can send it to another YouTuber or somebody else that can use the product and get the most from it. But so far I have gotten shut down or flat ignored by most people. Why is that? I don't know. Maybe they just think I'm, I don't, I don't really know why. But I can tell you this, that if any of you that are my subscribers or watching my videos and see that I have something that I'm getting rid of, I promise you that if you guys ask me for it, if I'm throwing it away or giving it away or I have a lot of it, 
and send me your information, I will send you those things. I have no issues with that. Whether I have 20 subscribers, 20,000, 2 million, I will always take the time to do that for you guys because that is the biggest thing for me is YouTubers should be supporting each other and helping, helping each other out in any way. And I just don't see that. I don't. So, you know, ugh, it irritates me. It's like, what the hell? Remember where you came from as well. We all started out somewhere on the bottom and some excel way up to the top and some don't. So next time you guys are dropping out your makeup drawer and going to throw it in the trash or take it to a shelter or whatever, which shelters are a good idea as well. Take it the time to really think, is there a YouTuber out there that could need that stuff a lot? And if there is, Take the time to really think about what you're doing. And if you want people to view you kind of in a poor light because you aren't, you're willing to throw it away or drop it off somewhere for other people that need it. But when someone is clearly there telling you that they need it in their situation and you ignored that, it would be, it's no different. So sorry, I had to rant this out but it just something that really upset me and i promise that that's not something i will ever do to any of you ever that's just it's so wrong like it brought me to tears to see how it how that's happening youtubers are a community of people that should be helping each other no matter what and especially for the new ones so Thank you guys for listening to me rant and rave and be totally honest on my opinion and views of things as well as my review of my hair stuff and get ready for this video as well as a few other videos that will be coming your way soon. I promise I'm going to start picking up on my blogging as much as possible. Man, my teeth look great <laughs> right now. So... I love you guys very much and I hope that you enjoy this video and please post comments below if you're new hit that like and subscribe let me know how you guys feel about this I'm not getting a lot of likes on my videos or thumbs down so for all my subscribers come on what are you doing love you